spouse of a U.S. citizen from start to finish typically takes from 10 to 17 months to obtain a green card. You know, um, it's an average, is an estimated time, but it can take longer. Um, it just de it just depends on, you know, again, where you are in your process, where is the person located, and, you know, what the waiting times are in that specific country, whether that embassy is caught up, are they not, you know, what... But typically, because it is an immediate relative, a visa should be made available immediately. And immediately does not mean like does not mean in an instant, but it does mean as soon as possible. Spouses of U.S. citizens living in the United States can file to adjust, um, you know, with the 130 and the 1485 at the same time. Typically, if you're in the U.S., it's going to take 10 to 13 months. Typically, it's an average, not an exact number. And if you're if you're gonna marry a U.S. citizen, but you live outside the United States, it takes typically 11 to 17 months to get a, a green card based on marriage. Again, these are estimates. Again, it's going to depend a lot on where you're at, whether you're in the U.S., whether you're outside the U.S., where you're from, whether you're doing a consular processing, whether you are not doing a consular processing because you were previously admitted to the U.S., you know, on a uh, on a visa and you overstayed, or whether you were admitted um, on a K-1 visa, which is a fiancé or fiancé visa. It, it depends, but those are typically what the waiting times are. Now, for spouses of um, green card holders or lawful permanent residents, from start to finish, the time is longer. It's typically anywhere from 23 to 38 months. And that's how long you will have to wait before you're, you're able to um, get a green card that becomes available to you once your spouse files the I-130, which is the adjust the petition based on uh, the fam family status.